I'd like to preface my comments by saying that I'm uncomfortable with this subject. I've known Carmelo Anthony for over 13 years, and I'm very sad about what I'm going to have to say right now. But it's the truth. Carmelo Anthony is going to be remembered from his days in New York as an individual who not only did not win, but as he should have, but never demanded a trade, consistently swore that he wanted to stay in New York, and as a result of that, gave the hits again. Oh. Anthony Stop. and his association with the New York Knicks were far more important to him than winning a championship. And he allowed himself to get pushed around by Phil Jackson. Ellis, and I mean it was a solid. You straight now. I knew going into the series it was going to be a lot of pressure. Years, Paul George of the Pacers has become the face of that franchise, first time All Star. Where do you see the MVP award going, Stephen A? Got to give it to Russell Westbrook with the sensational season he had, the one-man wrecking crew that he was. I will say this. 
it was nip and tuck for me until the last week and a half to two weeks of the season. I've been a James Harden guy all year long. I think he's been completely underappreciated in this MVP race, averaging 29, 11, and 8 for the season for a Houston Rockets team that ended up the third overall seed in the NBA and clearly within the Western Conference, for crying out loud. I thought James Harden was absolutely sensational. Then the last couple of weeks with their backs against the wall, per se, and the team appearing to slide, Russell Westbrook goes on the tier, has seven straight three triple doubles, like eight in the last nine games, and James Harden at tailed off and because it's a regular season award considering the way in, in which he carried the Oklahoma City Thunder who seemed to be absolutely nothing without him because every time he stepped oh, Capella gets oh, <laughs> You have to give the award to Russell Westbrook. The only other thing that I would say is this. They could call it a regular season award all they want to, which obviously it is. But if you're going to wait this long to announce it, don't tell me 